I get nervous playing in a suit because I'm so used to playing with no shirt on and just being free and I'm wondering like, oh, is my stick gonna get caught in the, in the cuff? Welcome Vanity Fair. This is how I get ready for the Oscars. My friend Adam Blackstone, who was my music director when I played with Eminem, Back in the day, hit me and he's like, man, we want to put together an all-star band and you, you got to do it with me. So, um, yeah, it was easy. I was like, of course, say less. We kind of just got together in, um, in LA and came up with a few ideas, like something Sheila was really into, something from one of my drum solos on a Blink tour, and then a Reba McIntyre song written by Dionne Warwick that's just amazing. It's pretty cool. But they're just like really like small bumpers, but yeah, it's a lot of fun. So like I never really have a glam team. Um, I never um, get like powder or anything, but this is the Oscars, so I'm like whatever, I'll do whatever. I mean, I like the juxtapose of, of me being at the Oscars. You know, it's like doesn't quite fit, but it does. Just like me in a suit doesn't quite fit, but it does. I was born in 1984, so like, you know, it's cool to work with someone that you grew up listening to. That's really awesome. He's a great guy, um, super talented, keeps it chill. So we moisturize and um, make sure that his head is shaved, make sure all his tattoos look good, make sure that, um, you know, he's not shiny on the carpet. Yeah, I mean, this is all new to me. Someone's handing me chapstick on a Q-tip. It's beautiful. Um, really for me is like, I put lotion on and make sure my nails are cut and my lips are moisturized, right? Yeah. Yeah, I'm like, I don't even know what to tell her to do because it's not my my pocket. I don't know, you know? I still get nervous every time I play. I feel like I shouldn't play or perform if I don't get nervous. That means I lost like my fire. I met my stylist, Chris, on a shoot for Nylon Magazine. I just brought a bunch of clothes and then he brought a bunch of clothes and it was like the first time where I was like, oh cool, he brought cool stuff, you know? And then, yeah, Chris has been with me ever since. Especially because you think of the Oscars, you think of black tie, tuxedo, but I didn't want to go into the traditional route of putting him in like a complete traditional like Armani tuxedo for his red carpet. Um, so I thought like a brand like Margiela will be the perfect um, complimentary designer for Travis because it's still such classic tailoring, but with a twist. And that's exactly what Travis is when it comes to his tailoring and his suiting options. For me, I kind of have a uniform that I really feel really comfortable in, which usually is like no shirt and a pair of pants and some Converse or, I don't know, some Doc Martens. Um, and now, like, I feel comfortable in a suit and I, I've found, like, suits that I like. I always feel like, I don't remember who said it, but, like, to feel like when you're wearing something, it doesn't, like, change you. Like, it's not, like, changing your identity, but you're, like, it's just enhancing yours and you still feel like yourself. In, in whatever these clothes are, you know? And I can like just see something or try it on immediately and be like, nope, like, that's not me. Like making sure the, clears, the clothes don't wear me and I wear the clothes is like, I think super important. Let me see these. I like those. What do you think? I don't know, let me see the other ones. I think they both work, I mean, it's up to you. Let's let Vanity Fair decide, what do you guys like? <laughs> These are like probably my go-to. Like these are probably closest to what I always wear. And I really love wearing sunglasses because they always shout at you on the red carpet to do stuff you don't want to. They're like, smile, do this. And you're just like, I can't even see you. Yeah, it's more, more my vibe. Yeah, I feel like an evil priest, Chris. <laughs> No, the key is, is don't eat too much before you play. You know? Or you'll feel, I don't know, feel some type of way when you're on stage. So yeah, banana is everything. And it gives you potassium, you don't cramp up, it's good. What else is in your like show diet that you have by yourself wrong to that? Um, matcha, I love matcha. Usually like a banana or an apple. It's just like a little... Ginseng. Yeah. I love ginseng. 
they, these little like capsules of ginseng that I'll take before I play. It's not really like a caffeine rush, it's more of just like very focused energy. Yeah, I'll do some push-ups, get myself like psyched up a little bit. That's pretty much it. Who wants to put some hands over?